An elderly man faces the prospect of dying in jail for his part in growing a $10 million cannabis crop, one of the state's largest. The 76-year-old has lung cancer, but illness and age didn't stop a judge from jailing him for a maximum of five years. A tip-off led police to 3,000 plants just weeks before they were ready to harvest. The crop had been nourished by gardener George Hatsiosafidis. Today, his wife wept as her 76-year-old husband was slapped with five years jail. What are you doing? I haven't done anything. Get lost. Hatsio Safidis was on the Pibinga property, 300 kilometres from Adelaide, when police busted the elaborate operation in 2011. That's quite evident, um, not only by the size of this uh, crop location, but also the complexity and the cost involved in setting up the irrigation lines, the pumps and the other equipment that's involved in uh, bringing this crop to such a healthy state. Hatsio Safidis claimed he was there fencing, but a jury rejected that, finding him guilty of cultivating a commercial quantity of drugs. Hatsio Safidis looked shocked as the sentence was handed down. With wide eyes, he looked over to his wife, who broke down in tears as her husband was led into the cells. Hatsio Safidis had asked for a suspended sentence given he's suffering lung cancer, but the judge thought he should have learned his lesson when he was jailed a decade ago for a similar offence in New South Wales. A farm manager was acquitted over the crop, a third man has already been jailed and a fourth has applied to withdraw his guilty plea. Hatsio Safidis will be 78 when he's eligible for parole. Kim Robertson, Nine News.